What is up, guys? I hope everyone is doing fine, having a great week this far. My idiot self found a way to not record somehow the last game, which was an absolute amazing game that I just played. And we happened to score with less than almost 30 seconds left off of the Jamison Crowder 60-yard pass that gave us this win. And I feel so bad about how this happened. I want to just go over this game, give you guys a complete breakdown before. And don't worry, we will get a game and we are going to be playing week 12 versus the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. So do not worry. We will still be playing a game, but we did grab a win as well. And I want to show you guys what happened. And we're going to break down this game before we head to Tampa and take on the Bucs. But I mean, we turned the football over. We didn't score that many points. We went blank in the first and third quarters. It, it's not really how you do it. I mean, it wasn't obviously a perfect game, but we scored and we moved the ball. And finally, I saw a almost just a real pass. Like, Kellen Mond threw for 271 yards. That's going to be his career high. And him throwing for two touchdowns as well is also huge for him, in my opinion. When you look at that rating, it, it doesn't look great. But at that same time, he threw a 72-yard pass to win it. He only took two sacks, 18 completions, higher than what Allen threw. I mean, he had a decent day other than the interceptions. And some of those interceptions are just bad reads. They just work. But, I mean, where this team is at right now is absolutely fine. And when you look at the, our schedule now, I mean, the way we started, we I really thought we would just continue to win games like that but you know we have three losses now sitting at a seven to three heading into week 12 pretty comfortable in the division now i would say we're still two games up though i don't know that's really not that comfortable in my opinion actually now now that i think about it but okay so i am sorry about how that week 11 game went down but i think th this is one of the best games we've had all season we're gonna go check out the tampa bay bucks roster real quick but these are the these are the moments you live for. We got Sunday night playing Tom Brady and his Super Bowl reigning Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Okay, pretty much the same team. I mean, they kept a lot of it together. It's going to be the same offense, pretty much that same core on defense. Really great secondary, pretty good front, really great interior run stopping defense. A lot of guys that are willing tacklers in that linebacking core and. You know, it, this is going to be probably our hardest game all year. It is. Um, Kellen Mond's going to be going up against a defense that has probably nine really talented Pro Bowl-esque players. You know, this is going to be a great test for him to see where he's at. And, you know, let's go to Raymond James Stadium here. Guys, again, I really want to apologize for what happened for that last video. It was a phenomenal game. And when I realized my error after the fact, I was absolutely irate. But, you know, a win is a win, and I'm sure you guys will believe me. You know, a 21-17 score, I, it, it, it was a phenomenal game. The, the specifics about that game that I'll have and always have when I talk about this season with this Jets team, it, it's phenomenal. So here we go. Fireworks coming down in South Florida. An 8-20 kickoff. Bruce Arians looks a little fired up. The GOAT looks a little fired up. Here we go. You know, the New York Jets have a history of Tom Brady. They do. They flat out do. And, you know, it, it isn't a good one. In no way, shape, or form is that a good history. And let's change that a little bit here. He's in a different color. He's in red. Maybe. Woohoo! What a. Sh wow. What a hit. He's going to wreck him down at the 24. And here comes TB. 12. Tom, first snap of the game, he's in the eye, drops back, looking to throw. Got a man. Mike Evans, he's got room to go. He's going to take it close to the 50-yard line, wrapped down by Ashton Davis and Blake Cashman. A 20-yard gain, Brady to Evans, right off the bat. Here's Tom, in the shotgun, Fournette to his left. Takes the snap from Jensen. Hands off. Fournette's not going to do anything. Trey Hendrickson on the stop. A gain of one for Ron... Oh, that's Ron Jones. Gain, for, gain a one for Ronald Jones. Sorry, Fournette more 27 in Jacksonville. Threw me off a little bit there, but... Watch the screen! 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 He's going to be stopped shy of that first down. Stopped by Blake Cashman and CJ Mosley. 
gain a six on that screen pass still, though. Here's Brady. He's going to get Ronald Jones for a first down. That's a gain of about seven. That puts him over 500 yards on the year for Ronald Jones. Good read there from Tom to hand it off and take the four yards, take the first down. Here they are in the eye. Brady, delayed handoff again. Hand off to Jones. Jones trying to get space to go. He's wrapped down by Quinn Williams. Just shy of the first down marker going to be a second and one here. I'm expecting pass. I really am. Doesn't make sense for them not to take a shot here. God! Trey Hendrickson wraps up almost a touchdown saving tackle. We cannot stop this run, dude. Ronald Jones, four for 28 early. Here's Brady in the eye. Hand off. That goes to Kendrick Vaughn for one yard. Second and nine coming up. Here's Brady. Second and nine for him at the Jet 22. Back to throw. Looking for a guy. He's got one. Oh! Did someone give me a fumble? That's an absolute haymaker. Here's Brady. Third and one here. Jones in the backfield. They're going to hand it to him. They're going to stop him. Jets all over that run. Jones can't get back to the line of scrimmage. A loss of one and we're off the football field. Defense. So here goes Tampa Bay. They're going to kick this extra point. Oh, no. Field goal. It's up and good. A 3 0 lead for Tom Brady and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers off their first drive. I'm actually happy with how we responded when they were down in the red zone. Stopped them on a third and short. Now we're on offense. Here we go. You know, last week wasn't smooth at all, but we scored when we needed to. Came out the dub. Gonna try to put a little more points on the board today. Kellen Mond back to throw. He's got a man. It's Devonta Smith for a gain of seven. Devin White takes him down. Mond's one for one. First pass of the day. Hits his other rookie counterpart there for a seven-yard gain. Here's Mond in a second and three. He drops back to throw. He's got a man. It's Chris Herndon. Chris Herndon, a gain of five. That's gonna be a first down for the Jets. Wrapped up by Antoine Winfield Jr. Mon, here he goes. RPO throws it out to Marvin Jones. Here goes Marvin. Marvin's going to have a shot to get that first down. He's going to be shy. Stopped at the eight. It stopped for a gain of eight. It's going to be a gate. Going to be a second and two coming up. Injured player on the ground. Unfortunately, that's Jameson Crowder. Sheesh. God. Come on, Perryman. Talk to me. Zell Perryman with a nice catch. Gets him down to the Tampa Bay 39, a gain of 13. What a throw from Kellen Mond. Here we go, three nothing here from Raymond James Stadium. <laughs> Kellen Mond, back to throw. Got a man, Devonta Smith, trying to get out on the run. He's gonna get another gain of eight, maybe nine. Tackled by Sean Murphy, Bunning. We're gonna keep Crowder in the game as well. Second and one. Here goes James Connor. Come on, James. Mond, hands, inside zone to Connor. Connor trying to find space. He's going to be wrapped down. But after he gets that first down, gain of three. Tackle on the play by Carl Joseph. Mond in the shotgun. Looking, trying to find a guy to throw to. Hits Devonta Smith. He's going to get a gain of five. That's going to be all, though. Tackle by Jamal Dean. Going to bring up a second and five for Mond and company. Second and five from the 22. Pretty much the same situation Brady was just in. Hand off, draw to Connor. He's going to have some blockers. James Connor's going to be close to the first down. Pushes ahead. Gets six. First down, Jets. Send Herndon on the streak here. See if that safety has safety vouches to go to the outside. And Come on, touchdown, baby. Jets, Chris Herndon. His first touchdown of the year. That's going for six. What a throw from Kellen Mond. Fired it in there. A little bit silent in Tampa. Going to take a 7-3 lead after Matt Gay attempts this extra point here. And that's up and good. Holds good by Darnold, 7-3. New York Jets, a nine play, 71 yard drive, capped off by a 15 yard Chris Herndon touchdown up the seam. See, I really like how wide open Herndon was there. And just to be able to use him in the slot like that and, you know, have our other weapons outside to take away that uh, safety in the middle of the field it was great to see. Chris Herndon finally making something happen. Here's Brady, his second drive of the game. Looking, throwing, right, get him! Bombs going down! Trey Hendrickson all over that one, and his 
third tackle of the game, and that's a sack on Tom Brady. Let's go, baby. Keep applying pressure. Brady in the shotgun. Jones is left. Scotty Miller. They're in a four. Oh, pick it. Pick it off. Someone's got to stay on your feet. That's going to be a third and 21 early here for them. Sit in the zone. Let them throw before the marker and we wrap up. Here's Brady in the shotgun. A long third and 21. Jones to his left. Drops back. Looking to throw. Trying to find a man. Looking. Throwing. Has one. He's short the first down anyway. That's going to be a gain of 13, 14 yards maybe. Stopped at the 28. Eight yards shy of the first down. Tampa's going to have to punt. Exactly what I wanted to do there. Make, make Tom throw it before the sticks. Trust our secondary to make a tackle. We made it. Now we have the ball, oh, ball back. Okay, that's fine. Asante Samuel Jr. takes that punt, returns it out to the 27-yard line. Here comes Kellen Mond on his second drive of the day. Mond back to throw. Looking, looking. He's got a man. Rob Gronkowski, drop pass. Mond's first incompletion of the day goes off the hands of Mr. Gronkowski himself. Here we go, second and 10. Hoping we can get Crowder out in some open space here. Kellen Mond, back to throw. Looking for a guy. He's going to get... He missed... Dang. He missed Jamison Crowder, who had a little room to work with. That's going to be incomplete. It's going to be a third and 10 here. Come on, Jamison. Oh, let's go. Come on, Connor. We got the first down, but it might be a hold. James Connor ran a great route, but it's going to come back. Sheesh. But I saw on the hold. Jeez. I really haven't hit, heard like his name involved with a hold all year long until then. But... That's going to bring back that first down, and now we're going to have to... Oh, he's going down. He's going down! Shaq Barrett all over Kellen Mond, dragging him down at the six. Going to be a fourth and 31. We're going to have to punt. Jeez, man, that's so annoying. We get the first down, we move the chains again. Call back. Now it's a fourth, the fourth and 31 from our own Zen zone. Two minutes remaining in this half. Not going to get the ball back, most likely. Kind of a terrible punt. Let's rock him. I guess they fair cast it, but at the 48, I did not see that. I did not see that, but okay. Not going to complain. Here's Brady, back to throw, looking, trying to find a guy. He's going to hit Godwin. Godwin gets it down to the 44. Here's Brady, back to throw, looking for a guy again. He's going to find one. That's going to be wrapped down. Ashton Davis makes a nice tackle on Ronald Jones. I'm going to call my timeout here. And we're going to try to get off the field in this third and four. It might be two down territory for Brady. They're kind of in the middle middle of the field, you know, third and four. But anyways, if we get a stop here, I just want to see what they'd want to do. Ah. Jeez, Chris Godwin gets a first down. That's going to bring him down to the 35. Brady's seven for eight on the day so far. 110 to go in this half. Bruce Arians has to call his first timeout. It's a 7-3 ball game with just a minute left to play in this half from Raymond's James Stadium. Here's Tom Brady from the 35. Ronald Jones to his right. He hits O.J. Howard. O.J. Howard on a little angle route gets nine. Just short of the first down. Going to be a second one coming up from 25 for Tom Brady and company. Jesus. Second and inches. Brady's been absolutely diluting my team right now. Dropping back. Looking. Throwing. It's got a man. Mike Evans all over Shaquille Griffin. Brady's nine for ten. Evans got 56. Heading into halftime. Let's send a little pressure. Let's send a little pressure. Dude. He's stupid. One-on-one -on -one routes. Marcus May. Marcus May, let's go. Wake up, please. He's been getting beat all year by tight ends. All year. It's been all year. I'm getting tired of it. Really tired of it. A six-play, 48-yard drive results in seven for the half from Brady. And now we're down three. Gotta need that. Don't waste the time. Do not waste, do not waste that time. We're gonna take this ball to 25 with 49 seconds to go. Two timeouts, down three. Okay, come on, someone get open, please. Mon, back to throw, looking to throw. No one open. You're killing me. Just let that clock tick now, probably. Second 18, dead. She. Come on, Crowder, get open. Let's go, get open. Ah! Damn it, timeout. Oh, I thought I had a touchdown, thought I had a touchdown, thought I had a touchdown. They literally make the shoestring tackle to save their lives, but Jameson Crowder had a one-on-one -on -one and was just absolutely... Go, Smith. Go, Smith, go! Go, Smith, go! Go, Smith, go! Devonta Smith to the house before halftime! A 51-yard score for the rookie from Alabama puts us up four. Kellen Mott absolutely having a day. Sheesh!
<laughs> That's amazing. Darnold pulled good, kick on its way. It's up and good for Matt Gay. A three play, 75 yard drive. Results in seven, capped by a 51 yard touchdown from Mond to Devonta Smith. Sheesh. I love that. I love that. A lot of big plays. I mean, we get that one to Crowder. I thought. I thought he was going to score. Then they wrapped him up and. The next play, we have a shot to Devonta Smith, and he's just wide open. And he makes a great move, run after catch, and just keeps hucking along the sideline. So we're going to be up four with the ball in this second half. Jeez. 14 points. Very efficient offensively in the first half. I, I mean, this hasn't happened a lot in games, has it? Sante Samuel Jr. trying to return it. He's going to get to the 22-yard line, but that is it. Really great start. I do not want to jinx myself, but I don't know if this could have started any. Oh, no. Wow. Devonta Smith draped all over. Good coverage by Winfield and Jamal Dean. We're going to try to include James Conner here in this, this second half a bit more. But we need to. If we get a little bit past half. Oh, go. Come on, James. Push. James Conner gets a James of 12. Gain of 12. If we get too pass happy, we're going to start throwing turnovers. It's going to happen. It's too good of a secondary to just be roasted all game long. I mean, all game long. Especially by a rookie quarterback. Missed him, dude. It's so annoying. I can't make simple throws like that, but I can make darts like I did on that last drive. Second and 10 looks like a stacked box. I really don't know if I could run this. Come on, Gronk. Get to that edge. Get to that edge. Let's go, Gronk. Talk to me nice. I'm telling you, that run after catch there is huge. Gain of 12 for Mr. Gronkowski. First and 10 here from their own 47. Kellen Mond snaps it. Jameson Crowder is trying to take it on the edge. Makes a juke move up. Tackled by about three X-Factors. Devin White, Shaq Barrett, and Carlton Davis. Not really one you be one, what you want to meet on that outside run there. Here's Connor, RPO, trying to get Vita Vea all over that one. Gain of two. Third and eight coming up. Third and eight. All right. I'm literally just going to copy what every team does to me. What every team does to me. Yep. Boop. Devonta Smith with another big gain. And our first down that moves the change to the Tampa Bay 36. Gain of 14. Devonta Smith, five for 87 today in a score. Now the rookie being really involved in this Jets offense now. Here's Mon, he hands off, inside zone, the crowd, Connor. Connor gets three yards, Devin White all over that one. It's gonna be a play action here. Mon, reading it, digesting the D, he gets it out. Trey Sermon's got space to go. Trey Sermon trying to get to the outside. He's got a first down, meets Devin White out bounds. Gain of 11, down to the 25. Trey Sermon, making things happen, the former Ohio State Buckeye. Ty Johnson now entering the game. He's gonna get a gain of five, tackled by Devin White at the 20 yard line. And off again. Connor looking for space to go. He's going to roll over. Get about three yards. Going to be a third and two here, actually. He got two yards in that run. Okay. Killing me. We're going to kick it. We're going to kick it. That play has worked all game, but now it, they, they, they're all over. Carlton Davis makes a great tack on Marvin Jones. Hold good from Donald. Kick good by Gay. We're going to take a seven-point lead and just trust our defense. That's smart football, it is. I don't want to, I mean, putting them away, getting seven, putting that lead to 11 would be nice. But at that same time, having seven just gives me some leeway to give a field goal on this next drive from the Bucks' offense and their first drive out of the half. I mean, for me to get three on that long of a drive is a little worrisome, but at that same time, there's not a lot of time left and it's going to be, oh. Dude, I don't get how he can catch that ball. He got absolutely drilled. I get it. He catches it, but two guys. I mean, I can't even tell you how many times I've fumbled on stuff like that. Now Brady's hot, of course. Of course. Dude, what? This is Ronald. Yeah. Sit down, Ronald Jones. Sit down. Put Kendrick Vaughn in the game. I dare you. Now they're going to be throwing it and throwing it and throwing it and throwing it. Jeez. Chris Godwin gets open for a gain of about 13, 14 yards down to the Jet 48. That's going to be the end of the third quarter. Tom Brady not having an excellent day by all means, but 
still in it, and we all know what he likes to do in these fourth quarters. Brady in the shotgun, four wide out set, Miller in the slot. He hits a man. That's a hell of a throw from Brady. Hits his guy, I think it was Johnson. 23-yard strike on the seam. Johnson, who made that huge catch in the playoffs versus the New Orleans Saints, makes a big one here. Chris Godwin with another catch of his, gets it down to the 14. Now Brady's really cooking. Now he's in a hurry. I could definitely see a run here. I'm going to send some pressure. Oh, no. He's short. Can we cover one-on-one? -on -one? Please. I need some help in that secondary, man. We're asking a lot of our linebackers to help cover on those slant routes. Let's go. That's three-yard stop. That's a three-yard loss. Sit down, Vaughn. Marcus May finally... He probably heard his name called after that score in the first half, and now it's the second goal from the four here. Brady's in the pistol. Might be another handoff. Drops back, looking, throwing, needing a guy. He might be, yes, go. No way he caught that. Uh-oh, they lost a yard. Perfect, perfect. Okay. Three wideouts to Brady's left. They're in the pistol yet again. No, the, come on. That's not even a pass. They literally threw it as soon as they snapped it. And OJ Howard just fell down in the end zone. How unfortunate. That annoys me. It bugs me a lot. 3.52 to go in this game. 17 all on Sunday night football. A chance to go 8-3 and three for the New York Jets and Rob Sulla. His first season as the head coach. A lot on the line for Kellen Mond, who's had an absolute day. 12 for 16, 181, two passing touchdowns. Best game of his short NFL career thus far. Needing seven more points to put this one in good position. Here he is. Jameson Crowder with a nice catch right off the bat. Beats Carlton Davis for a gain of 14. Here come the Jets. Mond hands it off. Connor's got space to go. James Connor trying to make moves. He's across midfield now. Down in the Tampa Bay 48. Clock's a ticking. His some carry of the game for 43 yards. 2.54 to go on that game clock. Connor looking for space to plug along to. He's going to get about four yards down at the 43. Gain of five, actually. They usually don't give me that extra yard. Generous. Generous. All right, 17. 17 apiece, 2.26. This is all you could ask for. All right, I like that spin. You see that? Love that animation. For sure, I'll take a third and one here. And guess what? We don't get it. We're going for it again. No doubt in my mind, there's none. Absolutely none. Uh-huh. We're passing it. Go. Go do your all-out blitz. I dare you. I dare you. Denied. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Go for it. Yeah, Bruce. Take, all, take your whole defense off the field. I dare you. Dare you. Oh, my God, dude. Zip this huge stack front. Come on. Give me some push up there. Dig deep. This is for the season. Mod, hands off. Connor, he's got the first down. Let's go. The New York Jets offensive line plunges through. That's how you do it. Mon handing. He's in the pistol. James Connor's going to have some space to go. He's got to gain a four. Vita Veo on the tackle. We're running the ball pretty well now. Just consistent holes. No negative yard. No yeah. Oh, yeah. Go, go, go. Did he get it? Did he get it? Did he get it? We're close. We're close. I say we're inches. I say we're inches. I say we're inches. Yes. That's fine. Let's work it. Run right at them. Run right behind 71 and Mekhi Beckton. He got it. Don't worry about it. Yeah, call that timeout, Brucey. Call that timeout, Brucey. This is fine. I'm letting all those timeouts burn. They can't do that stupid field goal thing on me. Here we go. Mond hands off to Connor yet again. James Connor's got another positive game in three. They stop him at the 20. We can run two more plays and kick it. Go Connor, go. Go Connor, go. Look at James Connor running the floor. Energy and a little power and a little drive. Gets it down to 11. Jets running games saving us right now. It is saving us. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. They should let him score. I don't understand what they're doing, but down at the 6, 23 seconds remaining. I am just going to let this tick, 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 down to five, six seconds, and we're going to attempt this extra, this pretty much extra point for the win. Timeout at three seconds remaining. 
from the six. Here comes Matt Gay. Sam Darnold in for the hold. Hold good, snap good, kick is down and away. It's up and good, that the Jets are going eight and three. The New York Jets grab it. Coming to Tampa Bay, beat Tom Brady, 20 to 17. Player of the game, Kellen Mond. Absolutely efficient in every way. Good completion percentage today. Threw for 200 yards almost. Two scores, kept the clock moving, was hitting receivers, no turnovers. A lot of positives there. Seven yards per play, 87 rushing yards. Out, we're, we out, we outplayed them in every possible category, in my opinion, I think, besides time of possession. You'd think, let's see, total offense, yes. Passing yards, yes. First downs, yes. Total yards, yes. Turnovers, pretty much the same. Third down conversions, they were better than us by a little, but we won, don't matter, don't matter. Red zone, three for three. See, that's rare. Time of possession, even that. 14 minutes to 10. That's how you do it. That's how you win football games in the National Football League, folks. That's how you do it. Kellen Mond, a 144.1 passer rating. That's all I could ask for for a 67 overall rookie. And Tom Brady played a hell of a game as well. But if he's throwing for 168 yards, I trust my team that we're going to win this game. The run game we have and our defense, I think we're, we're in a great spot. Longest pass of the day for Mond was a 51-yard strike to Devonta Smith, who also had the best game of his career thus far for five five catches, 87 yards, and a score. Had a great 51-yard run-after-catch score that right before the half. That wraps up Week 12 with this Jets franchise. We are now sitting pretty up top this division. I'm going to sim in one week, see what New England did and the rest of the division. But that's pretty much going to do it for this video here. Kellen Mond up to a 62 now. Progressing him, progressing him, progressing him. Eight and three Jets, baby. You don't see that a lot. You just don't. We're gonna advance a week. There he is. So New England's also six and five. They're right. They just keep trailing me. They just keep trailing me. But eight and three. Coming up with a stretch of one, two, three, four, five, five winnable games. We could run the table. Jack Jags, young team. Denver, young team, no really quarterback. Miami. In our division, we already played them. We know how they go. Bills already beat them. We know how they work. I mean, those two games are going to be the hardest in this five-game stretch of divisional games, obviously. But in my opinion, well, when you look at the division right now, those those two teams may be out of it. So they may not even be in that position to be playing for anything by week 16. And then we play the Carolina Panthers at home week 17. Let's run the table. Again, sorry about that last video. Hope you guys enjoyed the week 12, week 12 game, taking down Brady and company. Eight and three. Sure feels good. See you guys next week. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Inside the hashes on YouTube, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, whatever you have. Give us a search. You won't regret it.